Hello, and welcome back to SmackDown. This is Tiju22, and we are back for more action on SmackDown, and without wasting any more time, we have a number one contender match, and we have Jay Virtus, who won the right to be the number one contender. However, this match was made by the board of directors, and while Jay Virtus is still the number one contender, if nothing else, all he's really doing is preventing anyone else from getting into that championship match. And his two challengers, we have on the on the left of your screen, you have Unico, and on the right you have the current WWE champion, Jinder Mahal. But we'll find out if either Halt Mahal or Unigul are going to go to the Survivor Series, or if Jay Virtus is going to deny both of them. Without wasting any more time, let's get started right now. Gotta say, that last match, that submission match, was, in, was great between Corrido and... Uh, Jason RPG. So it just goes to show that Jason RPG is not someone you should trifle with. You really shouldn't. And that we already have a new 24-7 uh, champion in uh, McButterNugget John. And with that said, let's get it on right now. And... A spinning neckbreaker onto, onto uh, Jay Virtus. Now, this match is elimination style, and it is false count anywhere. There are no disqualifications, no countouts, and you can eliminate your opponents by pinfall or submission. And like I said, the last man standing is the winner. It, it's as simple as that. A suplex onto Jay Virtus uh, by Unigo, and it looks like both Mahal and Unigo are going to team up uh, against Jay Virtus. A Russian leg sweep to Jay Virtus. Oh, but Jay Virtus fighting back. And a huge right hand onto Unigo. And now Mahal takes over, whips him into the ropes, and a double gut buster onto Jay Virtus. And Mahal is now going to use the same move that LP Grotus just did to uh, Wolfbane two matches ago, and that's that hammerlock. But, nope, Jay Virtus counters out of it. And that was a great counter by Jay Virtus. Oh, and a nice hip toss, a modified hip toss, onto Jay Virtus. But as that happens, uh, Unigo is taking down the announce table. I mean, again, how many times has that table been targeted? I, I, I kind of lost track, though. In the meantime, Jay Virtus, well, he was handling uh, Mahal pretty well, but Mahal comes back. on a clothesline from Mahal to Jay Virtus. Ooh, nice counter by uh, Jay Virtus. Oh, but Jay Virtus fighting back though. A back suplex onto uh, Jay Virtus. Although Jay Virtus is uh, pissed. A Northern Light suplex onto Mahal. Hall. 
And now it looks like Unico and Jay Virtus are going to go right after Mahal. And Mahal, a suplex on Unico. Oh, and a rake in the eyes right to Unico. And a backstabber on to uh, Jinder Mahal. And an atomic drop on the Jay Virtus. A float over neck breaker on to Jay Virtus. And Unico from behind with a Russian leg sweep on to, uh, well, not the era, but more so um, the Indian sensation known as uh, Unico. And a, and a spear right to Mahal. A back body drop on to Mahal. In fact, Mahal was in that tournament, the uh, Survivor Series tournament, uh, but ultimately lost out to Chris Jericho. And now, wait a minute. Not even a one count. The referee was out of position. A head scissors takedown onto uh, Mahal. And now Unico exits the ring for whatever reason. I don't know. And now, Ted DiBiase, what is he? Oh, of course, I remember. These two are old rivals, and DiBiase just gave him a right hand. Yeah, they, those two were uh, rivals. Uh, especially when um, DiBiase was on his way out of the WWE. So, um, it looks like those two have rekindled their uh, feud with each other. And in the meantime, both or all three men are on the outside. Thrown back in the ring is Mahal. Or or Unico, excuse me. And now Jay Virtus goes after Mahal. And a back suplex and... Whoa, nice combination onto Mahal. And now it looks like Jay Virtus is going to beat the hell out of Mahal. And now Unico goes for the pin. Rev, what? Where the hell were you, man? Oh, he's in the ring. And whipped into the barricade is uh, Jay Virtus. Countered into an atomic drop. And thrown into the ring is Mahal. Elbow right to the head of Mahal. Alright, now all three men are in the ring. And... A, what is it? A surfboard stretch. On to Jay Virtus. And if Jay Virtus taps out here, we will have all but guaranteed another number one contender and it looks like that's the case as Jay Virtus has submitted and what the hell okay why the hell did you attack the referee that was kind of random how he just attacked the referee nope not even a one count but well now it's down to Mahal and uh, Unico And now Unico is just going to beat the hell out of Mahal. And that busted him open. And it looks like the toll that both Unico and Jay Virtus when he was out here might have taken its toll. One. Went for a Northern Light suplex with a pinfall, but Mahal still had enough to get out of it. And whipped into the corner is Mahal. Then a kick right to the leg. Oh, nice uh, spinning heel kick. Or front flip kick. That's that's what it is. Excuse me. And wait a minute. Ooh, power bomb onto Mahal. One. No. 
And whipped into the corner is Mahal. And a super arm drag on to Mahal. And Mahal on oh, a super gut buster on to Unico. And now he's just going to take the head and ram it onto the canvas is Mahal. Nope, not even a one count. And then an elbow right to the head of Mahal, uh, well, from Mahal to Unico. But a belly to belly onto Mahal. And right now Mahal is bleeding and he's got to have to try to find a way to end this match quickly. The longer this goes, the more it has to favor Unico. Not even a one count. Again, the referee out of position and now Mahal exiting the ring. But I think that was a ploy because he pulled down the rope and sent uh, Unico onto the outside. Then an elbow right to the sternum of Mahal. And Unico, what's he doing? And okay, now both men are on the outside. And a front flip onto uh, Mahal. Then an elbow right to the sternum, or the gut rather, of Mahal. And one, two, three. And the loss of blood was just too much. That. And because of it, Unico is now the second number one contender. We already have a match upcoming that's going to crown a number one contender in addition to Jay Virtus. And now this man, Unico. And that's going to be on the next show, but Unico, he played it smart. He played it smart. He made sure that he didn't get on the wrong side of a two-on-one beatdown. And then, when one of them was gone, all he had to do was pick the pieces of the other. And win in that fashion. But with that said, if I'm not mistaken, up next is the main event. And I have a main event treat for you guys. And it's coming up right after this.